What's up guys and welcome, you are watching Fazzy Fitness. Starting today's video with the guest posing of Terrence Ruffin. So we don't know which show is gonna be his first one of the season. Because earlier during the year he said he's gonna be doing two shows prior to the Olympia. And one of them is the Legion Sports and that show is still close to 10 weeks away. And judging by the way Terrence looked at this guest posing and judging by his conditioning, that looks very good. So there is a possibility that he might do a show before the Legion Sports. People are quick to forget, but Terrence is very complete. Just notice when he hits that front double bicep. His quads look bigger than before and as always, he had amazing flow. One of the questions that Terrence gets asked a lot is will he ever switch to 2 class in the future? And that is just based on one bad showing at this past Mr. Olympia when he did not place top 5. So I don't think Towns will ever consider switching to a bigger league. And why would he? A two times Arnold Classic champion, two times runner up at the Olympia. After Chris Bumstead, those are the highest stats by anyone competing in Classic right now. So the big question is, will Towns be able to get back in that top 3? Will he be able to beat the likes of Urs and Ramon again? The next update is from Antoine William to guest posed at the same event, weighing 300 pounds. Definitely the most entertaining guest poser of this era because every time he gets an opportunity to pose for the crowd, he comes up with a different and unique idea. His legs are massive, we all know that. But the lack of enough size on the upper half, especially compared to his lower body, that has been his major criticism. So what is next for Antoine? Is he gonna compete this year and try to qualify for the Olympia? Well, as of right now, the plan is to keep improving and step back on the Arnold Classic stage next year. It is so incredible that just two years ago when he was diagnosed with a heart condition, everyone thought that this was it. We would never see him compete again. And yet here he is at 300 pounds, looking at his best. So that Samson Dada posing video inspired others as well. Sebishiso Kotalo posted a similar posing video. I'm mentioning these two guys in the same sentence because Cebu and Samson go way back. In 2019, they were competing against each other and both of them were getting the third call-ups. And it is amazing to see Samson's career trajectory afterwards. But 2022 was quite a disappointing year for Cebu. I mean, he is a tall guy, he has got the structure, but he was far behind in terms of conditioning standards. His best was the Arnold Classic Brazil 2022, where somehow he missed the pre judging So Cebu is another guy who decided to skip the combative season this year and come back better in 2024. Hit the thumbs up button if you liked the video. And smash the subscribe button if you wanna come back for more. Thanks for watching.